as sad as it may be, hopefully it becomes a little better because we might have a baby. Hi everybody and welcome back to another episode of my Decades Challenge. I am excited for today's challenge because today is wedding day. Abraham gets married to Sila. So I just realized something. We have two fully grown cow plants. Um, so I need to make sure that I do not, that my sims do not eat the cake until it is the 1910s. Let me check and see how much longer do I have before then. Oh, so we still have another full week to go before it is. It will be at the end of summer and we are in winter. So we still have a ways to go. I might just put the cow plants away in my inventory until it's time for them to be around. I'll think about it. In the meantime, Doris is awake and she is making breakfast. Hopefully, today, we will have a wedding cake that is before the wedding. So, I had um, created, because it's winter and it's a blizzard, I created this, oh, oh, I gotta fix it. I created this barn. And um, just so that they can have the wedding inside. Okay. It's not much to it. It's just a simple little barn. Or as my daughter says, a barn. And I can show you the inside. So it's pretty simple. Outside they will have the cake and a little bonfire. But. The reason why I did that is because, like I said, I'm going to try and make it a tradition that somebody paints whoever is the couple of the day. Okay, so let us see what is going Oh, we need to pay some bills. Okay, and you're almost done with breakfast. He's cleaning outside. And you can go and brush your teeth for the morning. All right. I just pray that everything all works out for this particular wedding. So this is the first, um, no, not the first, this is the last, um, the last time that they will be eating as the just the family before the immediate family gets added on. Okay. Well, not the immediate, until the new family member comes in. Okay, so we are going to bake this cake. Oh, I'm sorry, I went into the wrong thing. I got too excited. Only... Right now, the only cake that we can make is a cupcake, but that's okay because she is going to make a nice cupcake. I'm not going to send him to school because I need him to stay home for the wedding. So, let's see if we can make it like a vacation day. Oh, it says on vacation. Okay, so that's good. Alright, so, and then he can have a bath. And let me see what he is doing. Okay, he loves sitting outside and looking. Let's see, what exactly is he looking at? Is he watching his daughter across the street? Yes, he is. <laughs> so that is where his daughter lives, across the street. Uh, but for some reason, he really enjoys sitting on the porch, just like a grandfather, rocking in his chair. All right. So this wedding cake is getting made. 
what time is the wedding? Let's see. Okay, I made it at 12, which is not bad. And I gotta give him something to do. So I am gonna let him go outside and practice painting from reference. And no, you are not getting on a phone because there is no such a thing as a phone. Why can't I get inside? In this room. Oh God. Okay. Now that is the barn. There we go. We can paint the blizzard. Okay, let us see. Okay, you're gonna go take yourself a nap. She's going to have herself a bath before the wedding. Oh, that is such a lovely cake. Look at that. Okay, so they are getting ready. I hope that the um, she's going to be cooking a meal for the big day as well. I hope everything is ready in time for the wedding. You know what I should do? Okay, while she's doing that, I'm going to take the cake, and I don't know if I should put it outside, because it's kind of cold. Oh well, looks nice. And somebody needs to handle that. Repair. You can't afford to have a broken toilet. Okay, so it's almost time. We're going to have about one hour left. I hope he did not go to school. No, he didn't. He'll... The wedding starts in one hour. Is your painting done? You're going to frame it and sell it. This is not bad. The timing for this is not bad. I guess the wedding is better prepared. Or at least I'm trying. <laughs> All right, wedding ceremony is about to begin. Are you ready to start? Yes, we are. Oh my God, the, ma, the mother-in-law to be and the bride have the exact same dress on. Oh God, oh well, it is what it is. Okay, so let us all walk down the aisle. And then we're going to have, you are going to two sons, it's going to be Abraham and Sila. This is already looking like a bad thing because I'm trying to click. Let me just click on him. Okay. 
I know everybody's freezing. Oh, oh wait, I got it. Oh shoot. His sister is there in her wedding dress. Okay. Once again, the wedding is not going like I planned. All I need is for everybody to take their seats. there we have it a beautiful wedding um, now they're gonna cut the cake hopefully this goes as planned and then I can have the painting being drawn all right I'm gonna try and get a picture of this Okay, so this is the best picture that I could get of them that he's going to start painting. I just needed him to just start the painting. Okay, and our wedding ceremony is over. It wasn't ending early. We can now have them move in together. So... Gibson. So Sila, you are going to move in and you'll have 23,000 so maybe we'll take 3,000 of what they have. Okay and this is the Gibson household. Now I'm going to head into my cast so that I can just Make sure that everybody has the same outfits and stuff, mainly Sila, and that I can change her last name. Wedding is all the wedding is all over, and we have a new household member, so she is gonna congratulate congratulate her daughter, her new daughter-in-law, and. She's just going to try to make some small talk with her daughter-in-law, um, just so that she to welcome her into the family. Um, okay. Oh, we have something else that needs to be repaired. Let's see, what else is that? Is that the bathtub? Yes, it is. All right. Let's see how much more longer does he have to live. Let's go over to Abel. Abel is the founding father of the... Oh, he has no more days. So his time could be any time. Oh, no, no, no. We're going to have your wife clean that up. And then let her use the bathroom. And Florence Griffith, congratulations on getting married to Sila. I hope you two are very happy together. Oh, we do too. 
and yes the brother is painting a lovely painting oh we need to take that black and white wedding portrait and once she is done she is gonna go to bed he's already in bed once he's done oh there we go why are your eyes so red probably tired oh sorry we gotta make it black and white and that's their picture okay so once you are done Abraham you're gonna grab a serving um, I just need to try to focus a little more on my married couple which I'm trying very hard to do but I can't So it's the wedding night and we're going to go down and speak to our beautiful bride. You're going to need the bathroom before you go to bed. And then it's bedtime for you and these two are the last two for bed okay so they're about to try for the baby and we're gonna give them their privacy So after a long day of everybody just having a wonderful wedding, peaceful wedding, everything went off, not exactly to plan, but our heir, our founder, sorry not heir, our founder Abel Gibson has passed. Okay, so we're just going to wake his wife up. so that she can see what has happened nobody actually knows what is going on okay everybody is coming So life has just become even more sad for my Doris because the love of her life is gone. Um, I'm going to put his grave outside. But I thank everybody for watching this episode. And as I always say, you like my videos, please subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button and the notification bell for more. Um, we'll be following the Gibson family again in the next episodes. As I said, it's just ended very, very sadly. Okay, so I changed out the, um, I removed the barn because I didn't need the barn anymore. And I put the cow plant back in 
um, this is where Abel is buried at okay so she's gonna leave a sugar a sugar skull offering for her husband and I added the plants back in and just some little tweaks and stuff here and there and I'm gonna let his wife let his wife go right back to bed it's been a long day for her well as sad as it may be hopefully it becomes a little better because we might have a baby in the next couple episodes um, one of our washing lines has broken so when they wake up I will let Abel, um, Abraham fix it 